Hi, uh, Bunga Handy Man here. Today we have uh, a sink and this thing is broken. It's jammed and the uh, drain is uh, a bit rusty. So what you're gonna do today is gonna show you guys how to change up for an, uh, change a new one and also how to change the uh, bottle trap that's under the sink. You guys stay tuned and before I begin, uh, do hit the like button and subscribe for more videos like this and uh, let's get into it. So as you can see here, the sink cover has popped off and looking at the cupboard below, you notice that it is in quite bad condition. And taking a closer look, you notice that the chrome has already rusted through and the pipe connecting the sink to the bottle trap is also rusted. We've got to change all this out. So you start by removing all the stuff that's under your sink. You don't want any of the drain water that will be coming out of the bottle trap to fall on your stuff. And then, of course, uh, put on some gloves. It's gonna get a bit gross. Now there are three rings on the bottle trap. Start by moving the top one. And then the one at the back. Uh, it's a bit tight, so I'm using uh, channel wrenches here. But as I turned it, uh, it kind of broke off. And it's corroded to a point that all the metal is so brittle that I could just snap it with my, my bare fingers. Now, in this case, the bottle trap has corroded to a point that it's so brittle, it just snapped off the entire fitting, uh, leaving the neck of the bottle trap behind. Uh, as you can see, it broke off right there, and this has to be changed. So we'll put that aside and grab our channel wrenches at the largest setting, and we're going to give the nut attached to the bottom of the sink uh, quite a good grip. Over here, I'm using a pair of uh, long nose pliers to hold on to the top of the sink while I turn the bottom nut. This is to prevent the stem from rotating as I'm turning. Once you have the drain removed, you might want to do a bit of cleaning to get rid of all the scum that's at the drain hole. And then, grabbing your new fitting, take everything apart. You notice there are two silicone gaskets, there's a thin one and a thick one. The thin one goes to the top and the thin one goes to the bottom. You put it around the stem of the drain and put it in place from the top of the sink. The fat one now goes to the bottom of the sink and is attached to the stem with the help of the new brass uh, retaining nut which comes in the set. You give it a few turns, and finally using your channel wrenches, you give it a final tighten. Uh, you want it to be fairly tight, but not too tight, because as I mentioned before, if you over tighten everything, you may risk cracking your sink, or even tearing through all the gaskets. The set also came with a new decorative grommet. Uh, there's one over there, but guess what? The blue is actually a protective film, so do remove that, and you will see that it's actually chrome. So I'm going to replace the old grommet with the new one, uh, just for decorative purposes. Now grab your shiny new bottle trap. There are three rings on it. You want to remove the front one first, and there's a black gasket inside the ring, right there. So you put the silver ring on the drain hole with the threads facing you, then stretch over the gasket around the, the pipe, and finally, you grab your bottle trap and you put it on the drain pipe. You want to make sure that the top of the bottle trap lines up with your sink drainage. And once you've got it confirmed, you tighten it up using the metal ring. Then you want to go ahead and screw it on to the drain and finally push down the retaining ring and give it a tighten. So 
So that's the easy way to swap out a, a bottle trap and a sink drain. Uh, follow step by step, shouldn't get anything wrong. All you need to do is check for leaks and tighten up where you need. Put a bit of pumice tape if necessary, a bit of silicone, and everything should be good as new. If you like that video, do give me a thumbs up, like, share, and subscribe on any uh, Facebook, Twitter, or whatever. And I'll see you on the next video. Take care.